Breaking, Californians send brutal message to Maxine Waters. Libs hate this. Who is Maxine Waters? Has she done anything of significance to make people's lives better during her more than 25 years in Congress? No, but she talks a lot about impeaching Trump, so she's become a mini celebrity every time Representative Waters opens her mouth, she convinces people of her complete senility. Now she's getting a taste of her own medicine as people are posting signs in Waters' California district calling for her impeachment via the blaze. It's happening. Impeach Maxine Waters sign spotted outside her town hall today. This trolling of epic proportion, the signs put up around Inglewood, California, expose Maxine Waters for the lying fraud she is. This woman doesn't care about her constituents. It's all about serving her own interests. Representative Waters has a long-time reputation as the most corrupt person in Congress. She's been investigated multiple times for ethics violations, using her position in Congress to secure business dealings for her family via the Los Angeles Times. In fact, Waters' family made over $1 million in eight years by doing business with companies whom the California congressman had helped with her legislation. Waters' pay-to-play scheme would make Hillary envious. Waters' politics consists of little more than the typical inner-city race-baiting peppered with reckless pork-barrel spending. Throughout her time in Congress, she's been known for little else besides her constant ethics investigations. The reason she's come into the limelight at all over the last months is because of her cartoonish attacks on President Trump. Waters literally says she will fight every day until Trump is impeached via the Washington Examiner. If only she fought so hard for her constituents, maybe Los Angeles would be free of poverty and crime by now. She's had long enough to do it, but Waters has been too busy looking busy and crusading against Trump. Waters also called Trump's team scumbags that is nothing more than projection. She calls others what she sees every time she looks in the mirror. Well, now even the people Walters represents are tiring of her incoherent ramblings. The signs posted all around the city are merciless and hilarious. One of the most genius of the signs mocks Waters' absurd claims against Trump. It pretends to quote her, censoring the president for getting two scoops of ice cream. Honestly, with all the craziness she spewed over the last several months, it wouldn't be surprising for that to be a real quote, spot on. It goes to show that even in the leftist haven of California, citizens are waking up. The progressive Shenanigans are wearing thin on everyone's patience. We're tired of Democrats acting like petulant children. What Americans from all backgrounds want is a government that acts to improve our lives. We want action on health care, on jobs, the economy, and national security, not the never-ending witch hunts against President Trump. Maxine Waters and her Democrat friends better learn the lesson from this. Otherwise, the ones impeached will be them. Let us know what you think in the comments below. And thank you so much for watching.